I did this video last year as a reply to a young woman saying that black men are no good, lousy sexual, and the best thing sexual ever was a white man. I also went into relationships. Now, not every man is different. Most men are the same in a lot more aspects than you think. So I basically told her how it would be in real world. And right now she was just living in a fantasy. And when reality kicked in, this white man was just a man. Not Superman. Not some wonderful great god. Not her master. This was a video reply. This video is not about a black man thinking sex is better with a white man. I'm going to clear that up for you for the first and last time. So when you people write dumb comments on the bottom of my videos, I do read the comments. I might not read them the day they would have wrote, but I read my comments. And I have to clarify something. This is YouTube. Most of us who do YouTube, who have a respect for the art which is YouTube, we will put a video up and let the video have its own life. I am guilty. I have pulled several videos because of controversy. I pulled at least three or four videos because what I said was completely taken out of context. One was a video about a suicide bomber, which I removed because I did not want a bunch of jihad coming my way. Two was a video about Mexicans and should black people help illegal aliens. I pulled that video due to death threats. And the third video I pulled because it was just stupid. It had no place on YouTube. So this video will not be pulled. Not because it got 6,000 some odd hits or what have you, or whatever it got. It's because what I was saying at that point in history was true. But at that point in time was true. And I did feel that way. I truly feel that every man is a man. If you love a woman, you are a man. If you are a black man and you were a white woman and you having problems, you're going to say some things that this white woman does not like or understand. If you are a white man and you have a black woman and there's an argument and or a fight, you may say some things that this black woman does not understand and does not want to hear. Period. And that in itself proves that every man is a man. All the same. Yes, I have heard white men call black women nigger. Black bitch. I've heard this shit. And I've sat there. I looked at her. It's a choice she made. Am I supposed to jump on some white dude for calling some sister out her name when that's the man she walked in with? And that's the man she walked out with? When you turn your nose up on a brother, a black man, and you are a black woman, and some white man call you up out your name, and this black man, see it? He gonna let you eat the pie that you baked. Period. Ain't nobody gonna run to somebody's defense for a choice they made. Now, I was uh, working at the restaurant year before last, and there was a young white man walking with his black girlfriend. Two other white guys walked up and started calling him all kind of nigger lovers. Now, we worked in Mexican Village, so motherfuckers was turning around like, what the fuck is this? Oh, no! But since these two white guys was yelling at a white man, didn't nobody get in their business. I could clearly see that the girl was stirred. Her boyfriend's being called all out his name. These people are getting very agitated. I said something. I said, you wouldn't be saying that shit to me if I was walking with a white girl, would you? Did I pull my video camera up in front of my face? Dude turned around, take that fucking camera off me. He was going to drop the end bomb on me, but his mouth broke. But he continued to heckle the young white man and his black girlfriend. 
these are white people how do you think this girl felt when her and her boyfriend got home I don't know I wasn't there I know how that black girl felt when she was calling being called all kind of niggers and shit by her white boyfriend she felt as if she was on the island and nobody would help her ass and everybody looking at her like shit that's your boyfriend the fuck we supposed to do jump on him and beat him up and then you go back to his house with him told you told you please no black man is going to fight for somebody who don't want to fight for themselves. And that's regardless of what color you are, who you are, or who you think you are. So, when I did that video so many years ago, and if you look at it, it says re, re. Look for the original video before you jump down my throat and say how gay I look. Alright? Please. Oh, some black guys talking about having sex with a white man. It's so much better. First of all, I never had sex with a white man. If having sex with a white man is anything like having sex with a white woman, then I have had sex with a white man. But, the woman didn't have a penis, so I guess it wasn't actually having sex with a white man. Am I irritating you enough yet? For you to understand the point I'm trying to get to across in this video. A man is a man. That's all I said in the other video. I'm not pulling my video down because the original video is gone. That is the life and reality of the real AIX. You will come across videos where I was battling the Sergeant Willie Pete. Who also no longer exists to people on YouTube. Think about the big picture. These videos are to inform, entertain, and to teach. Information and teaching is two different things. Hopefully you were entertained in this video and you learned something. You should have learned that the real AIX don't pull videos down because the other person has been flagged. The other person pulled their video because they were clowned down. That's that that's what hey J Ryder for if you watch this video, I want you to use the phrase clown down. Because oh well, you be you put people on blast. I clown people. Whatever I did in that video was so hardcore enough the girl pulled her video. I clowned her down. And you know, hey, shit happened. I shouldn't have pushed this video for 10 minutes. I apologize. And may those critics who say sexual things or write sexual things about the re re sex with a white guy, mmm, good, whatever it is, understands this. The real AIX is not a homosexual. The real AIX don't care for anything homosexual. The real AIX has homosexual friends who live in a homosexual world with other homosexuals. We say hi, we say bye, and I might get a dapper hug. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> okay. And that's it. I have lesbians in my family. I have a gay brother. So we need to get this understanding clear very crystal clear the real AIX love women I love mine in particular so please those critics out there who want to say the real AIX is really G-A-Y to the X wrong I know I can do the mannerisms and the voice and turn my head like this because I done seen them do that but please, man is a man. In the heat of battle and arguments and fights, men say things that they don't mean to say to their women, regardless if they are black or white. And yeah, for that idiot who said something negative about me, you've been tubed.